going to be doing a very interesting video. I know this is like all the trend right now, this whole metallic lipstick thing. Um, I buckled down and I purchased the uh, Milani Metallics, Amore Metallics. I only got a few of them. I think I purchased one other one. I purchased Chromatic Addict, um, Matley in Love, and Dramatic Diva. Anyway, my point is, is that metallic lipstick seem to be all the rage right now, and I'm not very much into metallic lipsticks. I purchased these because I wanted to see what they were all about. I do love Matley in Love. I'm just not a shiny kind of girl, I guess. If you are a shiny girl and you're into that, you might be into the lipstick trend. And right now, aside from the Milani Cosmetics uh, metallic, a more, a more metallic line, uh, matte lipsticks are becoming pricey. Even drugstore um, makeup is becoming a little pricey these days, I noticed. But today I'm going to show you how to create your own metallic lipstick at home. Right now Kylie Jenner has another run of her um, lipsticks out, which are the metallic, I don't know what they're called, but they're metallic lipsticks. And the black metallic lipstick seems to be like all over social media. And so I looked at it and I'm like, that can easily be done with some pure pigments, really. And today I'm going to show you how to do that. It's going to be so easy, so affordable. You guys are going to be like, Jessica, yes. So first we have to start off with obviously a black lipstick. I have with me right now Fergie by Wet n Wild. Um, this is in Pagan Angel. I did a tutorial using this, I want to say like a year or two ago. Um, I did like purple eyes and a black lip. I'm gonna link that down below if you do like this metallic lipstick and you're like, what the heck am I gonna wear it with? I will leave that lip down below so you guys can get some kind of inspiration for it, maybe? Anyway, this is Pagan Angels, very inexpensive. You can find it right now at your local, I picked this up at Rite Aid, I believe. No, Walgreens, I picked it up at Walgreens. Okay, so once you get to the top, and I believe Walgreens should have yeah. still the Fergie by Wet n Wild line there, like so. Curving away from you, you so know? we're gonna start off the by applying this baby. I'm just gonna lather it onto my lips and then we're going to metallic size it. It's not a word, but you know what I mean. The trick for me to, this looks so funny. Can you imagine if my lips were like this? Oh, so sad. The trick to applying, it's so freaky me looking at my screen and seeing my lips like this. The trick to applying black lipstick is basically using the tip of the lipstick first to outline your lips and then using the flat part to color it in. Makes it a lot easier and less messy. To make sure this baby doesn't feather, I'm just gonna go in with Max Night Moth and just outline my lips with the black lipstick already on there. I enjoy using Night Moth with my black lipsticks because it kind of softens it a little without killing it. You know what I mean? Now for the metallic part. What we're gonna do is you're gonna take like a palette that you can mix stuff on. I'm just gonna use the back of my NYC Levotics palette and I'm just gonna spray some setting spray. I'm using L'Oreal Infallible okay, Pro so Spray and Set. You can use anything here. really. It's You, you don't have to use this. You can use Max Prep and like Prime. You can use, you know, an NYX one. You can but use the Wet n Wild one. Any setting spray is gonna work and you're just gonna spray it a few times into here and it's just to um, create kind of like a mixing medium for your pigments. Um, the pigment I'm going to use is my Wet n Wild um, Leviathan. This is from the so we're done with this. This is from the Villains uh, collection, but you can use anything really that is like a pearlescent kind of um, finish. You can also use. I know Jessie's girl has one out right now. You can find it in Wall. Nope. You can find it at. Rite Aid, yeah, Rite Aid. Um, it's like a very, it's called um, Stardust, and that is a nice pearlescent kind of uh, shimmery color. I'm gonna take a lip pencil or a lip brush rather. I have my little mirror here from my Max Simpsons collection. You're gonna dip your brush into the setting spray first, and then you're gonna dip it into the 
Yes, the pigments. That's right, guys, the pigments. And then what we're gonna do is just make sure you have enough on here, like that. And then you're just gonna put it onto your lips. See what that is doing okay, already? So once you get to the top, yeah. what you're gonna it's do making it is making it nice and metallic. You're gonna curl backwards. That way it's like curving away from you, you know? But it'll lay right when you comb it down. Hopefully, hopefully we'll see. I'm gonna curl it downwards towards my face so that my bang. Okay, that's that. Now down. it is nice and so metallic this, this is what it looking. Like now we want to add a little more depth because obviously the Kylie Jenner lip kits, although they are sold out within direction. seconds, we all know um, because she swatches them on her lips that they do have some depth to it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add another pure pigment on top of this pearlescent silver. The one we're gonna add is Jessie's Girl Secret Weapon. I'm gonna use this because it has like a teal reflex in it. You can also use Max um, reflex pigments as well, uh, but I'm, I don't have that. I don't own any Max reflex pigments, but I do have my Jessie's Girl pigment and I do love it. I think it's amazing, so we're gonna use it. We're just gonna grab a little bit of the setting spray again a little bit of the pigment and we're just gonna focus that on the center of our lips okay so once you get to the top what you're gonna do is you're gonna curl backwards that way it's like curving away from you, you know? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like this can be done really with any lipstick. You can take a red, regular red lipstick that is not matte, obviously, and you can take a um, any a red pure pigment, a, an orange pure pigment, um, and just take it with some setting spray and just dab, 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 dab all over your lips and it will not move because it is mixed with a mixing so medium which is your setting spray to make it nice and sticky and it will become metallic. You don't have to spend extra money on metallic lipsticks. Um, it's just, I don't know, I feel like it's a trend that's not going to last for a very long time so I don't know that you would need to invest in a metallic lipstick when you can make any lipstick metallic so I hope this helped you guys I hope you found it interesting and if you did you know what to do hit the like button comment and subscribe and I will talk to you guys in my next one bye guys